Let's go. Hiva is an Spice Finnish people. How are you wherever you are? How are you spending your Independence Day? I am on a sleigh. I'm going to where are we going, babe? Hailing Kukulat. Yes, so we are using this. Okay, we lost the bag. <laughs> we lost the bag. <laughs> so we are turning around to get the bag. This is so much fun, guys. So I'm just sitting in this. They used to carry babies. They put babies in this, so I'm the baby now. Ah, this is so much fun. So, tell me, how do Finnish people spend the eternal spiva in Finnish day? What do you usually do in Finland? Yeah. They have great big traditions, but one thing that Finns love to do is to look at the Independence Day party taking place at the President's Castle. I think it starts at six o'clock or so, mm. and yeah, there's like hundreds of people who walk into the party, and the President shakes hands with all of them. Yeah. I'm not sure if that's taking place this Independence Day because of uh, COVID. I think it might. It might take place, but I think I hear that people are not forced to shake hands anymore. If you want, you can not shake hands. So the other thing that they do is that uh, from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. they lead up two candles. They leave two candles on the window. I think uh, if this is true, please let me know in the comment section. Uh, the story behind the two candles is that during the war uh, people had to put these two candles uh, on the window so that they would know that they are not their enemies. So if the soldiers saw the houses with two candles, they would go there maybe ask for shelter or water or something because then they would know that this is their friend's house. Another thing that the Finnish people do they put, they bake some sweets, like sweet cakes. What do you call those cakes? Pipari for Independence Day. And also, uh, I think the other thing that happens is, I don't know, what is it? Um, the flag, so they put like this small flags on the cake and also they lace the flag and sometimes they do the parade in Helsinki so these are some of the things that happen it's been snowing a lot so uh, it's today I think it's minus six degrees and we have a lot of snow uh, uh, approximately like what seven cents yes, you know what time it is it's yeah time for you to come here <gasps> Pedra's first downhill ride in a sledge. It's a very mild downhill. We're going to some bigger ones now. This is so much fun. Oh, look, they have laced the finish track there. You can see. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's a local school, so they have uh, the flag in full mast in celebration of the Finnish Independence Day. Yeah. 6th of uh, December 1917. Yeah, it's been 105 years now. Is it 105? 106. 106, yeah. So now we're just 
going to continue. This is so much fun. It's nice to do this, you know, outside. It's such a great experience. Ooh. So, are you enjoying this, babe? How is it for you pulling me in this? Yeah. I have been telling him to bring me to school these days like this. <laughs> it's so much fun. Except I'm not the baby. It's usually babies that do this. Oh, I'm a baby. Am I not a baby? I'm a baby. Hot baby. <laughs> Ooh, now I'm gonna slide again. Ooh. Here. Okay. All right. Now I'm gonna get up. Help me get up. Up. Ah! Let's go. So now we're just going to walk. And see you when we get there. Okay. So now we have arrived at the hill. So there are two hills, there's a bigger hill over there but there are some kids, so we don't want to have the kids in the video So we are going to go here first Try this one first We will film here And then later on we will go where the kids are This is so much fun Yeah And let me show you This is what I'm gonna be using to go down the hill slide. Go all the way to the road, you will stop there at the ditch at the very latest. Okay, so this is where I'm starting. So, yeah, this is, it doesn't look very steep on the camera, but yeah, it's enough to give you a very good speed. And there's some bumps on the way. So, this is now officially your second sledge ride. So, be careful, you will get some pretty good speed in there. Steer with your legs and Hold on to the sledge when it bounces. Good luck. I hope I don't break my leg. So she made it down the hill in one piece, just got sidetracked a little bit. But that's alright. I have to try again. Mm -hmm. We also have two of these. Uh, liukuri, I don't know, slider maybe in English. You just put it under your bum bum, uh, sit on it, and yeah, it's just a well, even a less less controlled way of going down the hill. So, how was it? It was good, but it didn't go as fast. <laughs> yeah, I saw you got a little bit off the track. <laughs> Gotta tie them shoelaces. Answer on two lists, it's very windy mm -hmm. and cold. So the wind hits your face over. Yeah. So, which way do you want to go next? There's an even steeper one over here. No, I don't want to go towards the trees. I mean, I'll try this one again. 
Okay. Sure. This is very funny. But too much braking, you have to go full speed, no brakes. No brakes? No brakes. Okay, the next one, no brakes. <laughs> now big guy is going to try this. <sighs> Let's see how it goes. Wow. Well done. That was fun. You have to come again. Again? Okay. Yes. <laughs> Two seconds. <laughs> yeah. So, how is this? Oh, it's great fun. Great fun. <laughs> it's been years since the last time I did that, so... Uh, good fun. <sighs> Such a great... Oh, now we have to climb to the top again. Yeah, Getting yeah. pretty warm over here. Yeah, it's a good exercise. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> oh, nice. He's celebrating. Oh, there is the pond, it's frozen now. How was it? Okay, your turn. Yeah. Right. You should also go that way. It's a good direction. I think I need to do this when I'm super drunk. <laughs> this isn't working. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you really liked it. <laughs> yeah, I hope so too. <laughs> like and subscribe. Yes, we had so much fun. Until next time. Bye.
GoPro stop recording. <laughs> he won't stop. <laughs> GoPro stop recording.